minority communities are beaten in Uttar Pradesh after the Congress and the Samajwadi Party formed an alliance. They finally have a viable alternative to vote for. There was nothing but depression in the minority community a few weeks ago when they were fearing that the BJP will come with at least 250 seats in the state. However, the new permutation and calculations that have come up after the Congress and the Samajwadi Party have announced their alliance, there is a feeling amongst community members that the Muslim vote will migrate back from the BSP to the Samajwadi Party Congress Alliance and that between the two parties they can get anything from 230 to 300 seats. While congressmen are upbeat and are hoping for at least 50 to 60 seats for the Congress Party and a share in the pie in the government and they hope to get at least two or three ministers in this new government that comes about in the state, there are chances that the biggest losers in this event shall be Mayawati and Asaduddin Oasi. There are also rumors that OAC is looking for an alliance with the Mayawati, uh, Mayawati in the hope of trying to prevent the Congress and the Samajwadi Party from sweeping the state. But the voters of Uttar Pradesh have not forgotten the lessons of Azamgarh. The voters of Azamgarh had voted blindly for the Ulama conference in the hope of bringing an all-Muslim party to power in Azamgarh. It did not work. The voters managed to split their vote between the Samajwadi Party and the Ulama Conference and as a result the BJP won in Azimbabwe. It seems the Muslim community will not make the mistake of letting their votes be divided this time and shall vote tact tactically in the hope of preventing the, the BJP from forming the government in the state.